What's up, you guys? We're here in our temporary studio. We're going to do something called a two-minute rant, where we pick a topic out of this bowl that's hiding behind the chair, and we have to talk about it for like two minutes or something like that. Yep. Uh, this was very much inspired by the Wheel of Mythicality over on Good Mythical More, and a Facebook post that I couldn't even begin to tell you who it was from, because all the names are blocked out. So there you go. <laughs> He's just going to sit there laughing for a second. I'm going to get a... Let's do this, man. I love ranting about stuff. Especially sports. I don't know so, if there's any sports in there, but why don't you grab a topic for us? I remember... Uh, there was one. All right. <laughs> pig farms. Okay, don't even get... Oh, got to start the timer. Don't even get me started on pig farms. You know what? It is ridiculous that we have not figured out how to make pigs bigger in the bacon area and how to make yeah. them... Bigger in the ham area. You know what? Pork chops, we can all live without pork chops. Let's be honest. But bacon, ribs, literally. Dude. Ribs. We need to make the ribs. We need more ribs. As well. You know what? Like, pig farmers, it's your job to make this happen. You need to start yeah. crossbreeding the big pigs with the big pigs. And maybe don't breed the little pigs. Still chop them up for bacon, though. Yep. Hey, bacon's bacon. We just want more of it. Exactly. We, and you know what, another thing, there's constantly all this news about farmers that it's like, oh, you know, unethical treatment of the animal. Stop that, okay? Yeah. Happy pigs make delicious bacon. Yep. I don't, I don't want to get bacon that's sad. It would taste, well, probably taste delicious as bacon. Uh, yeah. But still, I don't want pigs that are sad making me bacon. No. It's just ridiculous. Do you want to rant some? Because I kind of, I've been running this show for a minute. I... I was gonna tell say tell a story tell the that story. I experienced. I mean, tell the story. Pigs are gross. I actually hate pigs. They're not nice to each other. They they will fight each other to eat more food. They don't look out for their young or anything, and they're really really gross. When I lived in Illinois, I, I drove past a pig farm, and one like it was urinating like like a, a hose, a garden hose. It was just like going out and this other pig came walking up next to it and literally drank the piss before it hit the ground like we as kids would do when we're in the front yard playing around we're like man i'm thirsty but i don't want to go inside so you turn on the hose and you're like <laughs> yeah you don't pee in each other's mouths that's not recommended i saw a pig do that and it was disgusting that okay that's horrifying pig farmers stop that from happening yeah punish, Ugh. punish your pigs Ugh. But also, in a very real way, more bacon, please. Yeah. Larger bacon portions, larger ham portions, ribs. more ribs. If you can find a way to genetically make it so that pigs have like twice as many ribs. Yeah. The extra stack. I'd be fine with that. You got the half stack, full stack, and then the extra stack. It's called a rack. But exactly. Oh, dang it, you're that's right. That's what we want. We want we want a half rack, which the bigger pigs is going to end up being like 15 ribs. And we want the full rack, which is 30. And then we want the extra rack, which is both sides, which is 60 ribs, give which us, is enough for two men. Give us the entire rib cage. Yeah. Call it the rib cage. Literally. Outback Steakhouse. I'm looking at you. Let's patent that, actually. Outback Steakhouse. Don't steal our idea. Don't do it. All right, guys. This has been a two-minute rant. Uh, we're going to film a bunch of these in a row every time we film them. So we're probably going to be wearing the same, same clothes in a thing. lot. But, you know, we both have jobs, so we can't just hang out all the time. Yeah. Thank you for liking and commenting on this video. Yep. Subscribe. Do us a favor. Share it. We're at, we actually have, like, a really big plan in store. We're just trying to create a fan base, some people that can actually help support this really awesome cause that, that we want to do. So, yeah. You'll hear about More it soon. More on that later.